Um, definitely get my feet under myself. Um, starting to feel a lot more comfortable just playing with all the guys um, and whatnot and just the system. Um, but I mean, it's been a lot of fun so far and it's going to be fun in Orlando, so I'm excited for it. Is it nice having three guys here who have been in the Pacers system played on the roster for a couple seasons? It is. I mean, they know what it is. They know what practice is like in the real team. They know what games are like. They know how the system is really ran. So, I mean, it really helps having um, I mean, for me, those guys are basically veterans. I mean, they're not. They're very young guys, but I mean, them being in the league and being able to teach me some things really helps a lot. It's your first real glimpse of five-on-five -five action, I guess, at an NBA level. What stands out to you? I mean, just the shot clock being, being shorter is a big difference, but I mean, the game's faster, um, more physical, everyone's stronger, um, but I mean, that's pretty much what you expect going in. I know it's nice having EK here, but also nice having another UCLA teammate, Isaac, here with you for a little bit. Definitely. I mean, we all became so close this year, so it's extremely nice to have both of them here. Um, I think it just helps with the transition as well. So. The thing everyone talks about, as you said, is the speed of the game and how much different it is. Do you think you'll, you won't even realize how much different it is until you get down to games and some of them? Um, I would say so, yeah. <laughs> and even past that, I mean, once you get to real practice and real games, I think it only escalates um, because, I mean, once it gets to, to real time, people just, um, especially those vets, uh, really get into the game and, and really go all out. What is, what's your schedule? So you came here for the introduction, then have you yeah. remained here? Uh, then I went home for a day and a half. Uh, got some stuff, yeah, and then came came back. Uh, I mean, one, just getting better. I mean, every time I step on the court, I want to get better. Um, but, I mean, I want to win. I'm very competitive. I want to win. Um, so whatever I have to do for my team to try and get a win, I'm going to do that. That's one of the things, like, Lance talked at the end of the season. They need guys that fight or winners. Kevin, talk about it at your introductory press conference, just being a, a winner. Yeah, I mean, definitely. I mean, that's what the game's about at the end of the day. I mean, stats are all great. Everything's all great. But, I mean, at the end of the day, um, I want to get a win. Um, so, I mean, if, if that means I have to sacrifice some, some shots, some, some here, some there, um, a little something there, I mean, I don't care. As long as we get that win, um, that's what I'm most happy about. Are you one of those, whether, whatever you're doing, playing cards in the backyard, you're always – it means something? Yeah, I mean, it, it's kind of, uh, I guess, good and bad because, I mean, I'll be playing like a little kid in, in cards and I will never let them win. Um, I mean, I guess it's a blessing and a curse, but I mean, I'm just extremely com competitive in, in anything I do. So, have you found the, the competition here to be much different in college? Uh, it's you? definitely different. I mean, these are guys competing for a job. I mean, in college, I mean, most of those guys have, um, I mean, their scholarship or whatnot, or on the already on the team. So, I mean, it's definitely different. I mean. And it's just more of a business now. I mean, these guys are competing for jobs, and they're, and they're men. I mean, we're all men here, so I mean, it's definitely different. Yeah. Uh, do they have you on a strength program yet? Not yet. I'll uh, definitely come uh, after summer league. After summer league. Yeah. Yeah.